Yo, what's up? It's your boy KSI. I just got back from Sweden. Sweden. And uh, yeah, it was a Sidemen video. I look forward to that big video. Now, depending on when you watch this, I'm probably either in America or Australia. So if I'm in Australia, then I'm either in Perth doing a little meet and greet. Saturday, February the 11th, me and Logan are going to be there. The first 2,000 people get a free bottle of Prime. All the other details are on the screen. And then we're also going to Sydney. Monday, February the 13th, again, the first 2,000 people get a free bottle of Prime. Why are we going to Australia? It's because we're launching it. We're launching Prime in Australia. Hopefully it's more accessible in Australia than it is in the UK since no one can still get it here. And it's been almost a year of it being launched. But yes, it's gonna be lit. I can't wait to see you lot. I know you Australians have been begging, <laughs> begging for me to come to Australia. And now I'm finally doing it after so long. I'm excited for you to show me all the kangaroos. <laughs> I'm excited for you to teach me Australian slang. I'm excited for you to say the C word several times in every sentence. <laughs> and yeah, I'm just excited to explore Australia you know, for the first time in my life. But anyway, today we're going to try not to get cancelled. <laughs> we're going to be looking at some controversial or risky clips. And uh, yeah, just have a little bit of a watch, enjoy uh, or not enjoy so we don't get cancelled. And uh, yeah, without further ado, <laughs> let's do this. A man fills many roles in his lifetime. Okay. Provider, protector, master of the house. Okay. As a father, you have a vital role in your family's life. All right. They depend on you to be there. I feel like this, this feels kind of dated. Uh, <laughs> I know a few people would have different thoughts on this. We help to make sure you can fulfill that promise because no matter what they call you, at the end of the day, you know you're just dad. Wait, Confederate family, wait, what? Oh my, wait, what, why is the blood? <laughs> wait, no, no way that's real, man. <laughs> Run on! Come on, man! Come on! Dear young people, don't vote. Don't vote. Everything's fine the way it is. Trump, that was us. He's our guy. Tax cuts for the rich? <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm rich as f Climate change? <laughs> That's a you problem. I'll be dead soon. Sure, <laughs> school shootings are sad. But I haven't been in a school for 50 years. Oh, God. I keep God. track of which lives matter. Sure you don't like it. So, you'll like some meme on Instagram. If the weather is nice, maybe you could go to one of those little marches. You might even share this video on Facebook. But you won't vote. You young people never do. But I do. I do. I do. Midterms. <laughs> Primaries. Every single election. We'll be there, but you won't. Because we're a generation of doers. Not whiners. And we're doing great. <laughs> I mean, they're not wrong. <laughs> they're not wrong. <laughs> that was too real. <laughs> Get a load of this. So my daughter comes by the house the other day, tells me and my wife that she's non-binary now. I was like, oh, well, that's interesting. Guess what? I'm non paying your rent anymore. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a stupid bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> that's it? Is everything okay? You seem a little, I don't know, quiet tonight. Yeah, everything's fine. Uh, yes, can I have two tickets? One man and one bitch that needs to do what I say? What? Wow. That's not funny, Chris. Here's your ticket. Pick that up. Chris, why are you acting like this? Pick that up and cook it into something delicious or knit what? it into something that's useful to me. <laughs> <laughs> um, are you ready to make out now? Is he a Sigma now? <laughs> the goal of the Sigma is to make sure the woman doesn't like you. <laughs> Only men will like you. <laughs> that is a true Sigma. Make out with men. <laughs> I'm taking the piss, I uh, chill, chill, don't come for me. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, wait, what? 
Ball out here means more than growling a young buck. Wait, what? I don't know if I want to watch this. It's a time it. of... I don't know if I want to watch this. It's an attack. Just so out of nowhere. The start of the clip and I'm reading the N-word. <laughs> Ball out here means more than growling a young buck. It's a time of crisp, clean morning air. And the sound, thundering stampede. It's a time when horses come down from the high pasture. And a man prepares for another tough winter. It's time for a nigger hair. An American cigarette. No, 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 no. There ain't no way this is real. Oh my God, it's real. Oh my god, it's real. It's real. What the hell? Oh my god, man. Alright, well, thank god this is in the past. People got away with crazy shit back in the day. Hi, I'm Gary. At the one and only Gary's Mattress. Now with locations in Koreatown and Little Tokyo. We are karate are chopping up prices. I just it's for you. Ah, Even we would buy it. Gary's mattress, we're blowing up prices! Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Man on hold! Man, bro, no, no. How was my man insulted? <laughs> so many different groups of people in less than 20 seconds. <laughs> bro, no, bro. Bro, no, 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 no. I don't know about this one. I don't know about this one, you know? I don't know. <laughs> If you find a mattress at a better price, I'll kick a puppy and punch a kitten just for you. Honestly, <laughs> I think you're just <laughs> going to have an angry mob coming <laughs> to your store. It's pissed off everyone at that point. <laughs> Not the black people, though. He didn't touch the black people. He, he knew his line. <laughs> he had a line, believe it or not, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Women see sex like buying a car, though. Um, you know, they ask questions like, can I see myself with this long term? Is it safe? Is it reliable? Can it kill me? <laughs> Guys look at sex more like parking a car. So it's like, ah, oh, there's a spot. There's another spot. There's <laughs> another spot. Do I have to pay? <laughs> nah, never mind. Handicapped. Let's just hope no one sees. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That was funny. Oh, yeah, children. Chef, we need butter to gain about 50 pounds fast. 50 pounds? Why? Uh, school project. Well, if you want him to get really fat as fast as possible, one of you will have to marry him. Marry him? It definitely works for every woman I ever met. Oh, no, no, no. I ain't getting married. My parents will grow. Wait, what? Yeah, none of us want to marry butters. <laughs> oh, that, that is... <laughs> that is... <laughs> I see you. I see you. He has... I'm glad they think it's so funny. Who thinks it's The funny? audience. I'm glad they think it's The funny. audience doesn't think it's yeah, funny. Yeah, they do. They're laughing. I can hear no, it. No, they're not laughing. Oh, get over it. You are too. No, they're not laughing. And if anybody is laughing, it's terribly inappropriate to be laughing. They shouldn't be laughing. It isn't funny. But they're I... all sitting there. They're making fun of you. They're thinking, I'm so stupid. <laughs> I can't handle this, Dr. Phil. I just can't. They're, they're I don't not, want to handle this anymore. They're, they're not making fun of you. Yes, what they I'm... are. I know how people are. I've known people all my life. Really? You get help, you narcissistic bitch. <laughs> you have no idea how much I want to slap <laughs> out of you. I thought you were... <laughs> None of your own family will even talk to you. They know what a bitch you are and said it's a wonder I'm even talking to you. Dr. Phil! I don't think that Dr. Phil clip was real. There's no way, bro. She was literally, like, hella upset. And then he talking to her like, yeah, I'm about to slap you in the face. What? Found a lovely little news article that I think right. is really going to cheer you up. This okay. is a lovely news article about someone who's just found love. Woman oh. sexually attracted to objects announces she's in a relationship with a plane. Okay. <laughs> right. She's uh, sexually attracted to the real plane, and this is just a model. Um, so she's an object homosexual. She's sexually attracted to objects, which I am as well. Uh, women. Oh. 
<laughs> oh, oh, that's a joke. Dear Chill out. Me. Sometimes you do look at a person and go, "You've got a weird kink." Yeah, but there's weird kinks, and then there's trying to put the nose of a plane in you. So it says she even has fifty modical replicas in her bed that she sleeps with and gets physical with. She's going to shove that. Do you reckon she fucks that model? Of what a do you plane? mean? What do you reckon? How that nose is <laughs> going right inside her? There's no way. I reckon she gets down to the hapag writing. <laughs> Mate, she, she's going to have all of first class inside of. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm with my 737, I'm over the moon. I love him so incredibly much. I just feel safe with him and I want to spend all my time it's with clearly him. clearly not a Malaysian Airlines one then. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I, I mean, fair play. If you want to be attracted to an object, then so be it. But I just don't know if it's the one. <laughs> Imagine she was attracted to cactuses. <laughs> That's a long day. <laughs> or a great day, apparently. <laughs> For her, maybe. Gold dust, washing powder. Okay, at least there wasn't any racist. I just gave this place a good scrubbing, but everything is still dull as dishwater. Okay. Miss Ann's gonna fret something fierce. Who is you? I'm Goldie. I'm Dusty. We're, We're the Gold Dust Twins. Are you a slave to housework? No. Let no, the Gold Dust no. Twins emancipate you. No. 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 Next clip. I ain't doing it. I ain't doing it. I ain't doing it. I ain't. Do with it. I don't know. Nah, I don't trust it. I don't trust this next clip, man. I don't trust it. The Cartwright Institute for the Study of Freedom Illnesses. I just, I don't trust this. Surely this can't be outrageously racist. The Cartwright Institute. This, come on. I wanted a career working firsthand with doctors in a professional setting that didn't take four long years. I wanted to help all God's creatures, great and small, but my grades just weren't high enough for medical school. But now, I'm on the fast track to success. Train for a new and exciting career at CI, the Cartwright Institute for the Study of Freedom Illnesses. In just months, not years, CI can train you for a rewarding career as an overseer, patty roller, servant monitor, breeder, or get an associate's degree in e-slave accounting. Perform medical experiments. Learn the nature of freedom diseases. You'll be proud working firsthand with doctors, tackling the challenges of Negro peculiarities. Become that person you always knew you could be. Okay. Call CI today. No, no, we're done. We're done. We're done. We, we've seen enough. This has been your boy KSI. We've we've seen enough. No, I can't be bothered. I can't be bothered. <laughs> I'll see you on the bed. Take care and peace. I let go every time I hear those voices in my head. Trying to figure out why you still in my mind